Hey everyone, I'm going to fire up Frankenbox today and I just want to show you an update that they had in Android uh, on the bottom there where the uh, temperature readings are T1, T2, T3, T4 they were actually uh, their dashes now and when you plug your probes in they uh, the degrees would be in white now they're going to be in blue so you know when your uh, probes are plugged in so I'm going to plug the probes in one by one and you'll actually see them come online and they'll be in blue now which is really cool it really helps you out when you're in the field alright so all my probes have come online so I'm gonna uh, fire up Frankenbox and I'm gonna show you low suction pressure and uh, we're just gonna have some fun here stay tuned Okay, here's an example of what you would see out in the field. This is actually beer can cold here. This is 206, 60. So the pressures are great. The, uh, the evaporator is 32. Superheat, the, the, the pressures are good. But the superheat is on 2.6. Suction line temperature is 35. Uh, you're looking at beer can cold there. But let's run a little bit of air across that evaporator and see what happens when we clean the evaporator and uh, change the filter you're going to see your superheat come up your suction line temperature is going to come up suction pressure is going to come up this is the way it should be running so look at the difference we have here now wait till everything gets settled out the suction line temperature is coming up 54 degrees now, superheat's looking perfect. Evaporator's getting warm. Now we're getting some exchange. Now the unit's working properly. I just want to show you what beer canned cold looked like and what a proper charge looks like. Alright. Now let's just uh, throw that. Uh, pleated filter in there, see what happens. Uh oh. Look at our look at our uh, super heat start taking a dive. The suction pressure starting to come down. Not good. Beer can colts coming back. Oh no. Oh no. We're losing everything on the low side. Oh my god. We're gonna, just, we're gonna start icing up. One, one more time. Let's give a little, little air across that evaporator. Put the correct size filter in, and everything's gonna change on the low side there. Pretty cool stuff, you can see it in real time. Alrighty, thanks for watching.